hey guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is stephanie but you can go ahead and call me steph because honey we are friends now okay first and foremost i just want to go ahead and announce that i have officially reached 100 subscribers and i'm just so grateful and thankful for you guys i'm gonna be coming to you with more content of course but i'm just so happy and just feel so fulfilled that i've reached this goal, I had a goal to get to 100 subscribers by March of 2021, and I have officially can check that off my list. So I'm just thankful and grateful for that. So first of all, like, I'm just so happy you guys. And I just wanna say again, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting my channel. I really appreciate it. And I'm gonna continue to give you great content. Um, and just, yeah, so. Just want to say that thank you so much all right so um and then again before we get into this video go ahead and hit that like button go ahead and hit subscribe if you're not subscribed already go ahead and hit that bell so you're notified every time i post a new video your girl's on a schedule now so i'll be posting every wednesday um at one o'clock so please go ahead and take a look at my other videos if you haven't already check those out but definitely go ahead and hit that bell so you're notified every time i make a post and then go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already yes so um also go ahead and and, and also follow me on instagram make sure that you're following me because i'm also dropping some gems and, and and i have some upcoming things that i want to do on my instagram i will be doing some reels and some other stuff that i'm excited for into this upcoming next month of february so there's a lot of stuff and great content coming um on both platforms so go ahead and take a look at that as well the link of my instagram will be in the description below so life update y'all literally there's just so much going on and it's even just thinking about what I, what I like how I started this channel and like where the space that I was in of like creativity and just everything like that like honestly like I'm you know I'm not trying to get emotional about this but like I'm just like again I'm thankful for the 100 subscribers because when I did start this channel I was in a place where um my aunt who was my aunt on my mother's side so my mother's sister um she was um diagnosed with pancreatic cancer at the time and i remember i wanted to start a youtube channel since 2018 like 2018 i wanted to start a youtube channel like i had i have videos on my phone where like i recorded myself like going to i, I went to barbados at the time with my dad and i was like oh i should record and i recorded clips and everything of me and but I never posted it. I just never felt like um, I was good enough, or I felt like I would. I, never, I just didn't feel like like. Can I really like? Can I really do this? Can I really like? Can I really start a YouTube channel? Like, would people really watch me? Um, and I just remember just like battling myself. So I have like I have literally video clips in my in my phone of when I was trying to vlog um that trip and just trying to do different stuff and like just not feeling like um it was worth posting or somebody would watch me and um fast forward to june um 2020 when i was in a place also where one i'm just growing my trying to grow my photography business and i'm continuing to grow and realizing i'm, I'm also right now in a, in a place in and we'll get more into that of like my shift in my mindset right now um but i was in a place where one i was seeing my aunt who was very sick and very ill and seeing my family and just seeing the pain that they were going through and that we were going through and then recognizing that i only have one life to live and like recognizing and seeing her i'm sorry y'all um, recognizing and seeing her um, be so sick and knowing um, hold up I gotta get a tissue for this sorry y'all so and knowing um, knowing that 
knowing that for me, most of the women of, in my family were, were very strong. We're just anything that comes against us or anything that comes our way and challenges or whatever, we're able, like, we may not like it, but we're able to face it and we're able to get through it. And so seeing that my aunt was so sick and knowing how strong she was and how, and how I'm used to seeing her and seeing how weak she was and seeing how her body and everything was looking, it was just like hard for me. It was hard for me to see that. Um, and I just remember thinking like, I knew she never wanted me to, um, Sorry. Oh, I stop apologizing for my feelings. Ooh, okay, we gotta get out of that. But I know she never wanted me to like hide myself or she would always encourage me to be myself. Like even when I was a kid, I was always bigger. And so um I remember I used to get discouraged about dance class and stuff because all the other girls and stuff would be able to do splits and I used to feel like, oh I'm too big to do a split. And she she showed me because my aunt was always um, a plus size woman. Like most of my family um, on my mom's side, they're plus size women. So she showed me how to do splits. She showed me how to do stuff. And so she always encouraged me that like, don't like, you can dance, you can do all this stuff. Like don't let, don't, don't think like that. And so I knew that seeing her being sick, just let me know that like, Seeing her being sick was let me know that I needed to do this for myself. I shouldn't be afraid of being who I am and I shouldn't be afraid of, of doing something that I really wanted to do. Um, and so now we're here um, and she passed away in July. And so that was the quickest um, And that was so hard, you know, that was really hard. That was really something that was a hard pill to like even swallow. Like, I was just like, wow, like I just found out my aunt is sick. And then like, not even a whole month later, I lose her. And so that's been my push um, for like really putting like content out there and everything and really just like being unapologetic about like the outfits that I'm choosing and like, wearing what I really want to do and just doing stuff that I really enjoy just because I knew that she didn't want me to I know she would want me to live my life and live my life how I want my want how I would want to live my life and so honey it's just been it's just been so much so in between you know the content that i've been putting out there for you guys and everything i've also been just battling with like the grief um and also right now i'm about to be in the transition of moving to a new apartment and um within that transition it's just been it's just been a lot like you know like life is happening you know what i'm saying like life is happening so i um I say all that to say like yeah this is a part of my life of my life update to let you guys know like you know I'm a happy person but like also like you know I'm going through some stuff and I know that you guys are going through some things so it's okay to 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 be going through things and also trying to reach your goals like it's naturally going to happen but know that like live your life the way that you want to live it like just I know like for a, a while like sometimes it would cripple me um some days where I would just feel like um what is the legacy I'm about to leave like feeling like um what I'm doing is just never good enough I would always just feel like that too like I would just feel like man like I, I need to be here I need to be doing that but like I've literally just had to sh have a shift in my mindset of like the fact that like I'm trying I'm doing stuff I'm growing I'm learning and in that aspect like that's the beautiful thing is that you're continuing to grow and you're continuing to learn and that in, in itself is not failure so like give yourself some more credit so I just want you guys to know that for yourself because I'm having to work on that um and yeah so I don't know if you if you haven't seen any of my previous videos like just know that I am also 
um, in therapy. So I've been working with my therapist also on like my boundaries because I do have issues with that, with uh, like my family members and my friends and everything like that because I would choose to like put their their needs over myself a lot of the time and so sometimes i will feel bogged down i'll feel overwhelmed and so again that will get me in a state of shutdown so just being mindful of all of those things and like this is something that excites me like getting dressed being cute doing different stuff having fun dancing all of those things that's something that definitely excites me and makes me feel better and so i enjoy doing stuff like that so that's what i'm gonna continue to do um as i'm going on this journey of like getting ready to move i will do an empty apartment tour so you guys can see the new apartment that i will be moving into and then um right now this apartment is kind of in shambles and i kind of want to um get rid of a lot of stuff not kind of but i do feel like i need to get rid of a lot of stuff because it's just like girl you need to get rid of it like i don't i want to let some stuff go um especially things that I've been holding on from the past and everything I feel like I really need to let go of some things um clothes wise I mean just I have so much stuff like it just doesn't even make sense um but yeah um also I am officially ambassador for this um for this boutique called for the nine so I will also link their Instagram and my code down below that you can shop um their looks and use my code to get some money off your next purchase so i'm excited about that um uh i just honestly like y'all like i'm just beginning into existence like 2021 like i'm about to see like it's my year all this sort of stuff i just feel like i know that there's going to be so many blessings that's going to be coming into the year um it's just been crazy like uh, you know last year was just there was just so many different things and it just opened my eyes to like Stephanie, you're not living the life that you really want to live. So I think that that is what really has shifted my gears and shifted my mindset into where I am today, where I'm still a work in progress, you guys. Like I said, I'm like working on my boundaries. Um, as you can see, your girl is an emotional being. So it's just like working through that, being an empath also, like understanding what that meant. We like figured that out, like, okay, I'm an empath and understanding what that actually means. So being an empath, it's just like I'm basically I'm just feeling other people's emotions and energies and all of that. And all of that can be very overwhelming. And so, like I said, I have issues with boundaries. So I always put other people's needs over myself because I feel how they could possibly feel or how they're feeling and everything like that. And I think that that was also a struggle for me um, once my aunt passed because it just kind of I just felt I just felt so heavy and so that was just really hard for me at the time but I really wanted to push through because I really wanted to um I really wanted to live I really wanted to live a life that I that I always want imagine it to be and that's just where I'm at right now I'm working I'm really working hard to really put together the pieces for my photography business and who I really want to work with and I realized like I really want to work in brand photography specifically personal brand photography and working with business owners um, who really just need um, some great photos for their websites all of the different things that they need for social media everything but also um my content creators like myself who really want somebody that can connect with and will really understand them so that's something that i really am working towards and i want to have some more content towards that as well on my channel and so yeah um outside of that like your girl's also on a journey of trying to eat healthier and everything like that because i have been eating so bad and i'm you know i do I have had issues in the past where I was emotionally eating and so I want to get to a point where now like I'm taking back control of like not eating so crazy too many sweets all that different type of stuff so working out eating clean that's really like a part of my goals for for this year so I've already reached the 100 subscribers goal for my channel right now but I do want to get to the point where I'm actually I would like to see myself in this year 2021 to get monetized to actually like get monetized I really want to get to that point so that is my goal so really want to have some growth I'm really pushing myself to get get those things I want some some brand sponsorships all of these different things and I want to have some great clients for my photography brand 
and I just want to show you guys some love and support so y'all let me know in the comments below also how I can show up for you guys because I know how hard it is to not feel supported and not feel like you have somebody that is in your corner or like can understand where you're coming from so please like definitely let me know how I can support you show up for you for you guys because you've shown up for me and I'm so thankful and grateful for you all um we have like again it's just like it's nothing for, it's nothing but up like no like there's nowhere but up right now I'm just so grateful so thankful um this is there honestly like there's there's so much going on in the world regardless but I really just appreciate the fact that love is still there and I'm just so grateful and thankful so I'm about to close out this video just again you guys go ahead and like comment subscribe go ahead and share this with somebody that you feel like might touch them somebody that needs that push or drive so go ahead and start their youtube channel let them know like look like there might be you know you might be doubting yourself or whatever you might have recorded a whole bunch of videos post them they're not going to be perfect like i know like some of my videos like the lighting is like not the best or like there's something going on but they have the ability to grow and get better so why not just go ahead and share it you don't know who that who is going to touch you don't know who is this going to inspire so go ahead and make that video go ahead and make that video talking with my hands talking with my hands <laughs> yes go ahead and make that video again go ahead and follow me on instagram stephanie brianna underscore go ahead and show you girls some love on there go ahead and follow me and y'all it's a new year i hope that y'all are blessed i hope that y'all are receiving these blessings y'all are open to receiving good things in your lives you're worthy of all things um and i just encourage you guys to stay motivated take time to really you know self-reflect have some moments of silence and allow yourself to, to listen to your thoughts listen to your body know when you need to have some rest I'm also talking to myself. Know when you need to have some rest. Know when you need to pour into your body, give yourself some water, some good nourishment, all of that. So, without further ado, I love y'all. Hope y'all enjoy this video. Have a good one. Bye. <laughs>